Hey everyone, welcome back to another episode of The Cooking Goth, and I'm here at Burger King on uh, Whitehall Boulevard in Fairmont, or if you want to call it Whitehall, uh, West Virginia. I'm going to get the Impossible Whopper that released yesterday. It is 100% Whopper and 0% beef. It has, uh, from what I've read, it, uh, it says that it's made from uh, soy protein, potato protein, uh, coconut oil, and uh, sunflower oil. Uh, there may be some other ingredients, but I didn't find any on the internet. Um, but here we go. I'm gonna go through the drive-through and I'm gonna get me one of these babies. Um, yes, hi. I'd like to order the uh, the Impossible Whopper in a meal. Okay. Um, I would like to have that large with a, uh, I guess, a, um, a Dr. Pepper. Or if you have Mr. Pibb. Mr. Pepper. Okay. Also, um, I read on the internet that you guys can make it on a separate grill. Uh, no, that'll be fine. It, it'll be fine. Um, yeah, that that's all I'd like right now. Um, Is that all for you? Yeah, that's all for it. All right, you said it was 879 second window. All right, thank you. You're welcome. So the internet kind of lied, I think. Or maybe this one establishment can't do it. But it's fine. Hello. Hi. It's Thank you. Thank you. You guys been selling a lot of these today? I figure. <laughs> There's one for you. Thank you. Do you want any ketchup or anything? No, nah, it's fine. Alright, there's that. Thank you. That for you. Thank you, ma'am. I appreciate it. You too. Thank you. That was awesome service. That is service that you should come to expect whenever it comes to ordering food or just generally buying something from the public. I always come here, so I like it here. And here's what it looks like. I think it tastes good. Um, I don't think it's as juicy as their uh, burgers normally are. I don't say it's bad or anything. You should definitely try it out. I mean, I think it is good and I'll finish this. I don't feel as if I wasted my money. I mean, it certainly looks real. I mean, for the most part, I mean, you can kind of tell it's different than their normal, like, their normal uh, patties, like the end there. Um, But, I mean, if you like Burger King, you're definitely going to like this. Um, man, mm, I do like it. I see nothing wrong with it. If you're a vegetarian, I would suggest it. Also, on BK.com, you can look at their uh, their nutrition facts for this burger. Mm. 
And um, yeah, I'm glad I made the trip. And that's my review. I get a bit of a thumbs up. Come down here and get your Impossible Burger. Um, they released yesterday. Apparently they've been selling them like left and right today. So come on down. Come get your Impossible Whopper. I think I keep on saying Impossible Burger. I apologize for that if I did. Um, see you guys later. Thank you.